In our database, we have a single table which we created from a single entity using the Entity Framework Core. But in an app, you normally have multiple tables which are related to each other, this way adding complexity to the database structure. In this section, you'll not dive into all the database complexities, but you'll learn how to work with the relational data using the Entity Framework Core. But how many types of relationships are in a database? Well, there are three types of relationships that can exist between two entities. The first one is the one-to-one -one relationship, and an example would be a person and a passport. So, a single person has a passport, and a passport can belong to a single person. Another type is the one-to-many relationship, and an example would be a book publisher and a book. A book publisher can publish multiple books, but a book can be published by a single book publisher. And the last one is the many-to-many -many relationship, and an example would be an author and a book. An author can write multiple books, and a book can be written by multiple authors. But what are you going to learn throughout this chapter? You'll start this chapter by adding a one-to-many relationship. For that, you'll create a publisher entity, define the relationship, and add the migration to update the database. Next, you'll add a many-to-many -many relationship by adding an author entity, and then by the end, you'll learn how to get the child or the dependent entities and also remove the child entities when you remove the parent one. So, let's get started.